It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Arbor Ales and it's a bottle of their Super Yakima American Double IPA. This one's coming in at 9.5% ABV, described as an export strength double IPA brewed using Washington DC Yakima Valley hops. Looking forward to it. Black bottle cap. Now, did I know that the hops were from Washington DC? Do I look that knowledgeable? No. No, I nearly said Japan. I'm doing a live feed at the moment on Instagram. Uh, people are watching on Instagram while I review this beer here on on YouTube. So um, if you want to follow that, it's Real Ale Guide on Instagram. Follow me, uh, Instagram.com forward slash Real Ale Guide. Um, but yeah, I was ne I nearly went with with, with Japan because it sounds Japanese, and they were like, no, no, it's from Washington D.C. But yeah, bottle conditioned, it was, look at that. The beer is available from imperialbeerclub.com. Check out the link in the description box below. But that looks fantastic, doesn't it? Lots of suspended yeast floating around in that glass of beer. No head whatsoever. To me, I kind of, this, now, there's a style for a beer like this now. They call it an, an East style double IPA. So this is your kind of your, your treehouse brewing company's haze. Uh, they brew a naturally hazy double IPA. So the Brits have got onto it, of course, and this is probably um, their version of it. So let's get the aroma. Oh. Smells wonderful, absolutely wonderful. Banging, banging hop aroma. A big, bold, grapefruit, spicy, citrusy, orange peel. Smells wonderful. Let's dive in. Cheers, everyone. Oh, ho, ho. yes, gonna put it down. Boom, Stone the Crows. What a beer, Stone the Crows. It's, it's got a nice, rich, malty sweetness to it. That then moves over into a hop sensation of complete flavor and bitterness. But through that transaction, through that transition from being sweet and malty over to bitter and, and hoppy, the flavour as it moves through creates a licorice, a lovely Bertie Bassett licorice taste in the mouth. Spicy, lovely, bitter, orange, spicy blood orange flavours. Wow. Wow. Let's get back in. Oh, you can almost chew on the malts. You can always, it's almost as if you want to get a knife and fork and and slice into the malts. It's, it's that much of a big, soupy, malty, biscuity, bready loveliness. It's like walking through a, the French countryside first thing in the morning, coming across the, the nearest town where the bakery is baking fresh baguettes and you have that lovely, fresh big bread aroma and that's what you're getting from this beer wow what a beer what a beer Ugh. and then the hops the yakima valley hops from washington thank you instagram <laughs> um marmalade oh, what a touch of black currant in there it's very jammy it's very kind of it's like warm jam on toast 
spicy marmalade. Oh, it's 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 lovely. Bitter on the back end. Oh. And you get a little touch of alcohol. From that 9.5% ABV, look at that. You get just a touch of alcohol and it's it's enough, you know, it's it's enough to push the beer around inside of the mouth and yeah. It's great. There's a warming sensation going down into the pit of the stomach. Love the mouthfeel, love the carbonation, love that maltiness, love the hoppiness. It's time to rate it. Arbor Ales Super Yakima American Double IPA. I'm going to rate this. I'm going to give it a 9 out of 10. It's a 9 out of 10 from Reload Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box. Subscribe to our daily beer reviews. Give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! And cheers.